Hey guys, it's Andrew with Hoffman Lawn Fertilization out here looking at a client's lawn. And this spring they had asked me about seeding. And typically we don't really recommend seeding in the springtime. And they've struggled to get grass to come in here. With this section, because it's isolated, it is something where we can get away with it. And the way that we're gonna do that is we're gonna put down a nice soil layer here so we've got a good seed bed. And then we're gonna also make sure that we cover it with straw. Straw is gonna be a key indicator to our applicators. So that way they will know that something is going on here. Their seed that we're attempting to get to germinate, we cannot put our first two treatments on it. And our first two treatments are gonna be pre-emergent. Uh, last step, uh, all we need to do is water it down. And it's not really that I'm concerned about watering the seed, it's more so the straw. It's a windy day out here today. In order to get that straw to bind together, it's gotta get wet. So when I'm watering this in, I'm very careful not to let the water puddle. If it puddles, the seed's gonna float, it's gonna move, and then it's gonna you know, just be uneven. So again, I'm just, my goal here is just to wet the straw so it binds together and doesn't blow off into the, the rest of the log. All right, cool, got a uh, soil down, got our seed, straw, wetted the straw, raked it all in. Uh, should expect germination typically with seed in about three weeks. It's still really cold out here, so might add an additional couple weeks to that. Not really that concerned, uh, you know, mother nature, right? It's gonna warm up. That seed's gonna germinate when it's good and ready, when it's got enough moisture to do so. Um, but yeah, should fill in this season. All right. <laughs> 